Hey boys, it's Harm Nan. Today I'm in Grand Theft Auto Online with NPC and Twingo, and we are doing another customization battle. If you didn't see last week's, we did the Spectre Custom, and we're gonna have to find out who is going to have to sell their car based on the voting totals from the last video. And in today's customization battle, we are gonna be customizing the Bravado Gauntlet Interceptor. So this should be pretty interesting. Let's go ahead and get started. All right. We're, since they're close, we're starting with first place. Obviously, it's going to Mr. Twingo with 696 votes. Almost what? 700. That's Twingo kind of crazy. Twingo won? Yeah. I thought then Hanon was going to win. Split by five votes for <laughs> second and third. Oh, man. Harmnon <gasps> will be receiving second place no. with 446 NPC oh, yeah. 441. Yeah. Oh, oh what yeah. What are you guys doing? How Everything did Twingo right. win? Because I'm the best. <laughs> Look at this thing. Dude. It's so the funny. The orange oh is so God. sick. On it's it. so funny, too, though, because we actually roasted Twingo. We didn't even really roast NPC at all in the yeah. roasting part. And uh, and NPC True. still loses. That's crazy. Bro, it's it's a little, I don't know, like... I guess it's a little boring. I should have gone for pink, honestly. A little bit. It was a I grand won. slam for me. I almost actually, if I got best lap, it would be a grand slam. Yeah, but I'm so been. happy yeah. I won that race. Yeah, true. That was epic. True. Oh. Well, thanks for taking votes maybe, from. Maybe that's oh, why. Oh, actually, no. You took Didn't votes matter, from me. Actually, yeah. You took votes. I from almost me. had you. I think Harmon should have just won by like a landslide. For he you should have went a little rewarded. bit slower and then let me get best lap. I I should have went faster and uh instead of hiding behind you and trying to do a gta npc maneuver to try to win the race nice good, good job good job <sighs> accuracy all right Wait, gentlemen. i want to see, see the sussy plate yeah, it does too that's so funny ssy i think it means sissy yeah i think you're hey, sissy no. <laughs> that's rude all right gentlemen here we are with the bravado gauntlet interceptor um i have a very interesting build in mind uh, here today so we're going to start off by going all the way up on everything we're going to just fully customize all the uh, performance modifications and everything like that uh, transmission will do that turbo will do that as far as the ride height goes i think i'm going to lower it by like a couple but i don't know if i should go all the way down maybe i should let's let's go all the way down why not okay and then for the windows we're going to tint them all the way out and then I have like, I have like kind of a build in mind that I want to go for here. And it's going to be like a really, really cool, like sleeper build. I think it's going to actually turn out really well. Um, I'm going to leave the stock front bumper. So it's uh, the black color to match up with the rear bumper as well. Um, wheelie bar and shoot. I'm not going to go for that today. For the exhaust, I am going to go for probably the big bore exhaust, I think. Um... Or we could go tuner. No, I think Big Boy looks a little better. Um, and for the grill, I also want to go for the um, black open grill because that's going to match up with the uh, with the front bumper there and the rear bumper. And then for the headlight covers, we could go for some. I'm not a really big fan of it though, so I don't think that I'm actually going to go for this. Yeah, I think I'm going to leave it alone. Uh, for the hood, I'm going to go for the maybe the vented hood or maybe just keep it stock, honestly. I might keep it stock. Stock wouldn't be bad. The vented hood, though, would be kind of cool, too. Mm, not really sure. Could also go for the carbon hood. You know what? We're going to come back to that. We're going to come back to that. We're going to go xenon for the lights and then for the livery. Um, so we could go for all kinds of different things, but I'm thinking of going for no livery and going for a undercover build, which I think could be really, really cool. So um, we're going to see what kind of goes on here but um as far as like the tech arrays and stuff like that i'm going to avoid putting that on search lights i'm also going to avoid those emergency lighting i'm going to actually remove it entirely and then um you can see there's just the two front things there and then there's those there um and then i'm not sure if that actually if it has something in the rear window i would assume that it probably does um but that should be kind of interesting and then i also want to go for i think i'm either going to go no push bar in the front or i'm going to go for like one that's like pretty subtle but at the same time i don't think it's going to really work so um i'm going to just leave it alone i think i'm going to keep the stock rear panel as well uh, because I feel like it looks pretty good and then I wanted to do this in sort of a, a just a dark color that's like kind of unassuming like maybe an anthracite black or like a black or dark steel maybe black steel I feel like that could be kind of cool like that sort of thing and then 
uh, let's see, what else can we do here? We got the roof. We could go for a carbon roof or something just to like kind of kind of throw off anybody who thinks that I'm a cop, you know? Maybe maybe do something like that. Maybe, I don't know. Maybe not. We also got the primary color skirt or secondary color skirt. I'm not going to do that though. Uh, for the spoiler, we could go secondary or I could go plastic. I think I'm going to go plastic today. And then uh, suspension, we already got that. Wheels, I think I'm going to put on, I think I'm going to put on some sort of like regular wheels so that it doesn't seem like you know a straight up cop car i feel like maybe cheetahs i feel like cheetahs could look pretty good on this and then if we did those in maybe like maybe a bit of an off color maybe a black steel as well something like that uh that could be kind of sweet and then bulletproof the tires and then we got the windows already tinted out so I feel like this is like kind of cool looking actually. I feel like this is pretty sweet. The only other thing that I could also maybe do is go for like the carbon hood, which I think would kind of help to sell it a little bit more as well. So maybe we should actually go for that. And then we could even go for the roof in carbon potentially as well. And then maybe even we could do that spoiler in carbon on top of it all. This could actually be kind of sweet. Um, let's take this outside. We'll come back in if it, if it doesn't look good, but I feel like this could be like kind of a really cool build. Um, I would do it in a dark blue, uh, but I feel like I will get um, roasted for that because I'm not technically allowed to go for blue right now because I'm banned from it the same way Twingo's banned from, uh, from red and black, but I do feel like this actually looks really sweet and you can't really tell it's, you know, a police car without the lights on. Like it's pretty hard to tell so i feel like this could be really really cool to go for the only thing that i'm also thinking that we could maybe do is actually go for we could potentially go for a much brighter color as well i actually have a i actually have something that we could do that could be really interesting here let me go in here and let me go to the respray um and we could potentially go for um a midnight purple and then we could do uh, NP NPC did something like this a while ago. He went for a midnight purple um, and then he did a blue pearlescent on it um, of some sort and it kind of turned it into a dark blue but it was technically a purple so this is kind of a way that I could get around this potentially um, and we could do that with like a light blue potentially so it could be like galaxy blue um, and then keep the wheels in that color I think. Wait a minute let's let's see what this looks like outside. I feel like this looks really, really good. I feel like this looks really, really good. You know what? I think I'm actually gonna keep this. I think this looks better than it did before. I feel like it's a lot more interesting to look at. I think I think this is what I'm gonna go with, guys. I don't know. Let me know in the comments down below if you think it should have if I should have kept it in the gray. I want you to comment a one and if you like it in the purple with the blue pearlescent. So it's sort of like a galaxy blue. Uh, comment a two. So one if you like the last one, two if you like this one. Um, let's see what it looks like with the lights on too. Oh, that's sick. It looks really sick, actually. I really like this. This is really cool. Okay, um, well, let's wait for the other guys to get out here and then we'll uh, we'll see what we can do. Well, 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 it's a good thing that I changed my veil, isn't it? Hello, <laughs> we had the same idea. It's really funny that we had the same idea. I'm really glad. I'm really happy we came up with this idea because it looks awesome. It does look awesome. It's really cool. Oh, yeah. Um, I just, what, what color is this? This is a harbor blue okay. with uh shadows bluish silver pearlescent nice nice pretty I, sick right? i i had mine in a black steel so it, it looked really similar to yours but then oh, i came yeah. out and i changed it oh i i didn't notice you. oh my god it looks so crazy shiny in this angle where i know what yeah no it wow. looks insane um, i didn't notice the carbon at first that's kind of sick yeah, yeah i felt like the carbon was kind of cool i, I kind of wanted it to look like it was you know go to a takeover and then just bust people out of nowhere yeah like i'm thinking think like mine's like fresh out of the dealership kind of thing but yeah i don't know challenge you to race at a stoplight thing it's yeah pretty type, sick. type of thing yeah it's i like, hate that the radio up front is so visible it though. is it is really visible but if this car was sitting behind you in traffic like a ways back you would never know oh yeah you wouldn't know yeah lights are pretty hidden oh it's so cool yeah it's really sick i i'm cooking some oh yeah i'm you better be it's taking a while decent Wow, we Fellow got a state trooper. Oh yeah. I was about to go for that one. Oh, you guys 
Dude, your guys' cars don't even look like cop cars. What the heck? Oh, um, no, these no, are you muted. Oh, these are both like undercover. Where is he? What is he doing? Kinda, yeah, we both did undercover thing. builds. Pretty sick. Interesting. Oh, I'm not you're muted, buddy, or something. Oh my god, oh, my no. bad. My bad. Oh my god, okay. I was talking the whole time. My bad. Rip. Um, yeah. Nice. Yeah. Oh, Pretty very sick. undercover. Nice. Mm -hmm. Cool, cool. Mm hmm. Nice. Um, all right. Let's, well, all right. No we, more time wasting. Yeah. Yep. Let's get let's to the up. observatory. I'm up first, and I kind of went for this like Robocop, like cold, lifeless, dystopian officer kind of build. Um, I've got this in a black steel all the way through. Um, I've got heavy duty steelies. I went for the like lights. Uh, I don't know what you call it, like blocked off in both the front and the back because it's that's I don't know, like Robocop, Cybercop, whatever you want to call it. Um, I've got like a basic utility bar in the front or the push bar because I didn't want it to cover the state trooper thing. I just think like state trooper sounds so much more menacing than sheriff, you know? So that's what I went for. I went for a carbon splitter, um, the stock skirts because I think those are black. And then on the back end, uh, I didn't go for the wheelie bar because that's not very, like... Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah that's a little yeah, weird. I don't know yeah. why that would ever help you. Um, I went for the tuner exhaust because they're just, like, bigger big bores. I thought they looked nice. Um, and then I went for the tech array 3 because there's not, like, a bunch of poles sticking up everywhere. But I thought it was still... I just thought it fit the dystopian theme. Um, and the searchlights as well because I think if you're getting hunted by one of these guys, like, it's just, like... You need the searchlight because I don't have like the headlights. Yeah, um, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you definitely do. Um, mm -hmm. And then for the interior, just for more of a utility feel, I threw on a roll cage. Um, oh, you did. Mm -hmm. I thought it looked kind of cool just because, yeah, I mean, it just makes the inside feel a little fuller. And then I didn't touch the hood. I believe this is the stock hood. And then I have uh, the secondary or siren, like level two or something. Cause that one's like the most straight the most uniform yeah. which is kind of that that style i've got heavy duty steelies under the, the off-road category in black and then for the spoiler um this is just the secondary color stock spoiler so awesome yeah decent that's it awesome definitely getting some like blade runner 2049 kind yes. of vibes which is pretty sick yes yeah. that's exactly what i'm going for like that type of world oh nice. yeah Nice. All right. Okay. Okay. Cool. Ooh, let's talk mm -hmm. about this one. All right. So this is my build. Um, I have gone for a midnight purple, actually, with a light oh. blue pearlescent to escape my no going for blue curse. Um, <laughs> I thought you forgot for a second. No, I did not. It's midnight purple with light blue pearlescent. So, okay. Uh, it's pretty pretty cool. I originally had it in black steel, but I feel like the midnight purple with the blue pearlescent like was more of what I was kind of hoping to go for. Um, mm -hmm. I have black steel cheetahs on here. I have the stock front bumper. I have stock side skirts and stock uh, rear. Um, and then I went for the carbon hood, carbon roof, and carbon spoiler to like kind of give it like a you know to allude to the to you know maybe I'm just a guy driving a Hellcat and I just want to race you and then <coughs> you'll speed off and then my lights and sirens will turn on and you'll be instantly regretful of your decision you know because it's an undercover cop car other than that i didn't really do anything um i mean i think i went for the i went for the tuner exhaust or big bore exhaust the, the ones that are yeah, slightly big slightly bigger than the one um, that you start with uh, because uh -huh. I, I like the size of them a little bit better they're, they're pretty decent i also like that they're angled with the diffuser as well so mm -hmm. went for that um kept the uh whatever the stock rear like headlight thing or tail light thing is and then i went for the open grill in the front though because i feel like it looks a lot better mm -hmm. um and that's pretty much it i i didn't do anything else to it i feel like it you know i just wanted to make it look like sort of sort of just like a stock hellcat that you would mm -hmm. see just on the highway and hopefully you'd speed by them trying to get them to race you and then you know all of a sudden you get lit up and your life is over pretty much mm -hmm. so uh that's that that's my good. build that's my build very nice all that stuff reminds me a little bit about my build too we also went with mm -hmm. a undercover kind of vibe here i went with a harbor blue which is a little hard to tell right now it looks quite great but we did do a bluish silver pearlescent on it which is bringing out that shine quite a bit did a black steel on the rims similar to harm none and those are some sport endo v1s i believe I, I i don't know about you guys but i found it very hard to pick some wheels for this one 
But I, I think you just got to commit to the low profile and just forget about kinda it. Kind of do. I didn't commit. I wanted to do some muscle ones at first, but we decided on that one. We did the secondary spoiler. Uh, I do believe those are the same exhausts I have uh, with Harm None. I can't remember the name. Are they the tuna These ones are or the angle ones? The big ones? bores. Big bores. Those are the big bores? Okay. Yeah. Nice. Big bore game. Oddly enough. Pretty solid. Yeah. We did a one bit lowered suspension. A open grill in the front, gotta see those lights, and I think I kept all the black accents on the bottom, on the skirts and on the rear bumper there. Mm -hmm. Stock hood as well, no vents in there, um, and no police equipment stuff. That's about it, I think. Nice. Mm -hmm. Nice. Yeah. Cool. Awesome. All right. All right. Well. It's time. It's time. Sure is. And, Who are we uh, starting with? We're going to start with Harm None. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah. I think your carbon choice here is a little, <sighs> little odd. I don't think the odd. carbon looks the greatest on this car. I 100% agree. I, it's putting me off for some reason. I disagree. I think it looks very good. I think it's uh, similar to the ones in real life, except they don't use carbon. They just use another color. I didn't necessarily want carbon. I just kind of wanted another color. And I guess I could have gone for like secondary maybe. Um, but yeah, I could have gone for secondary, so that may be, may be a slight mistake, but I, I don't mind the carbon. I feel like the carbon's nice. I, I don't know I think why I don't like it exactly, but there's there's quite a lot of it, I think. Yeah. Maybe it's like the game, and when I move my camera around, it's like messing with my eyes a bit. Yeah, but no, it does tend to do that, but no, I don't know. You, I'm not the know, biggest fan. You know what it is. Okay, the first thing is that I, I just think like the edges of like where the carbon ends is a little odd. Or I don't know if it's because it's it's like such an a jarring like pattern against this really sleek blue that you have. And I think the blue looks great. And it's if a, maybe you purple, have like a black it's a purple actually. Okay, purple. <laughs> yeah, of course. Um if it was just like a straight black hood, I think it might look better. But like yeah. it just stands out so much. Like, like, I think really maybe it is the texture difference. Yeah. I, I, feel it like... also, I don't know. For me it might be like a bit too thin on the sides here. Yeah. That might be me, and I'm also I not a fan of how I it comes up to this first if, pillar. If it came out yeah. any further on the sides, it would look really bad. I think it should come into the hood a little more. Oh, okay. I, yeah. 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 I could see that. We'll, it's like we'll, the tiniest amount. We'll talk to Rockstar about it, making the oh, hood yeah. we'll a, little a, bit, a little bit uh, skinnier on the... Mr. Uh, Rockstar. On the Hellfire, you know? Uh, yeah. But, um, I don't know. I, I just kind of wanted to go with like the... Like, kind of like the... Um, the ones in real life, like they, you'll see some of them with like the black hood and then the black roof, and so I just did it in carbon. Uh, yeah. I know what you mean. Yeah, so I just what, feel like they have brighter colors though. Yeah, like, but I, I feel, feel like, like a lime green with like a, yeah, yeah, you know, like last time. But True, you, you yeah. can get them in like gray. You can you could do that to a purple one if you wanted to, or dark yeah. blue, or whatever, whatever you want to do. But I, I suppose I, I feel like it looks I feel like it looks quite good. Okay. Um, yeah, um, and then you could have gone for the carbon. Front part. I did not so I want either because if I go for the carbon front, I can't go for the carbon side skirts or rear diffuser. So I kept it black on the bottom, carbon on the top. That's Ooh. true, but they're so minor compared to the splitter, and like y you have so much carbon on the front end. I feel like you like, just said that I had too pattern. much carbon, and now you're trying to tell me to go for more carbon. Well, yeah, if you're already gonna go with the carbon, you might as well double down because now it looks lo it looks like you couldn't. I mean, decide. yeah, the front you splitter is quite more obvious. It's not carbon, and it probably would have blended in a little bit better. But I do see what you mean. How you can't change these. Yeah, you other can't ones. change the other ones. So but those ones are almost line. unnoticeable. I feel like. Yeah. You could okay. Get okay. Well. That's yeah. what if I had made the front, if I had made the front carbon, you'd be saying the exact opposite of what you're yeah, saying now. Yeah, but you didn't though, so we're saying it now. <laughs> you guys um, are scumbags. Other yeah. than that, I mean, I, I really like your color combo. Good way to avoid the uh, the blue primary trap mm -hmm. and uh, i love the combination with the wheel color i think the wheel color looks excellent on the cheetahs on this car in particular i think yes. he, did, he did a good job i agree thank you Based. thank you that. Uh, all right all right um, let's talk this, about npc's car let's, okay let's let's all right let's i gotta get awesome. it out of the way i don't really like the how you front covered thing up the lights is, is the worst thing i've ever seen i get that you're going for futuristic but my god that is ugly. i think the the i almost did like the bar grill kind of thing for mine when i was gonna do a proper cop car i mm -hmm. think that could be better but i also don't like how you covered up the taillights too because that's a pretty uh, important part of a cop car and those yeah, flashing taillights and headlights. I agree, and I don't like that it's got rivets on the back of it all the way around. 
Yeah, oh, but for our era and the rivets match these rims as well. Yeah, but, nah, but yeah. it's got that utility yeah. feel to it. Yeah, I also it's think like, their rims are kind of like not that copy. Like they're kind of copy, but they also just look like your mom went and got her snow tires put on. No, it's just it's just <laughs> supposed to be. Look, okay, there's trends in the future that we don't yet understand because it's in the future. You know, obviously oh, it's okay. gonna look it's gonna look a little jarring. So really, my car is unroastable. Um, <laughs> that is this is why I don't read fiction. All right, well. Speaking why do you also have one spotlight though? Why wouldn't you want? Yeah, the why two didn't you go for two? That's weird. And um, because because then it just looks like balls. <laughs> like I don't want balls in my car. This one looks. Oh, you're a not gonna more... see anything. You covered up the rest yeah, of your you lights. Yeah, you covered those lights. It's a little lights. more like tasteful. And nothing to see, man. Um, um, right. I also gotta say, speaking of carbon, oh Jesus. What the seats? Oh, those seats. Yeah, those I ain't gonna lie. The comfy. seats are these. Oh dude. man. Oh man. Imagine, I would hate to sit. In imagine one. sitting on one of those for a ten-hour shift, oh, patrolling, Listen, literally not patrol, even getting out of the car. Patrol like uh, out cop outfits in the future are just like they're way more cushiony. Like, right. It's, oh. It's okay. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Um, yes. I also yeah. think your I think your bull bar is a little boring. I feel like you could have gone for an, a more exciting one and still seen the state trooper. I i agree but then i would have gotten roasted because the, they all like curve backwards like it hooks backwards it curves up to the right oh um and they all cover the state trooper like it's like a line going straight through it i don't think like i would have i would not the words i don't think i would have roasted you for no that, i i can hear your voice in my head roasting me i head. don't think so oh, this roast. one looks like quite plastic yeah to me, it quite looks cheap. really boring yeah, it is. yeah the texture's awful on it yeah it's yeah. terrible to be fair it's hard to Hell. make a decision when it's all like gray and dark in the agency i don't know you had an extra 20 minutes after we were done and you still came up with it so i, I mean know, it, it I looks know. i'm just saying it's pretty fresh take on a cop car you guys just both uh, it's, have like it's, these normal ass hellfires it's unique yeah, they're right? undercover hellfires yeah, but it's undercover because yeah, because so, uh, bro the, the, know, thi man. the thing is like like cop car like police departments like they don't really have like actual hellfire police cars so i feel like going undercover is like the way to go like realistically like i don't know um i will say i think twingo's car is boring it, it is pretty boring it's it's like the what my specter was last episode it's like yeah, there's not really anything is, wrong yeah. with there's it not necessarily anything wrong with it i just think it's a there's nothing more. exciting about it i, yeah. I don't so, think i wanted it to be too exciting though i no, wanted no. to be like inconspicuous of like course, something that yeah. came uh, out of a dealership yeah i also i something about the way your suspension is sitting right now is pissing me off i think it needs to be what lowered by one more or raised by one more it's just it's kind of in between oh kind of i thought i just wanted to like just soften it a little bit kind of looks weird Still though pretty, pretty yeah good. It's got uh, some ground clearance. What did does. you do for your suspension? I, I lowered mine all the way, actually. All the way? I feel like it's a little too slammed, honestly. I, like, it's coming yeah, up I mean, the top of the wheel into the fender. I, I kind of was, was sure just more that. like, like, I want it to be, like, sort of like a modified, like, you know what I mean? Like, like going to a takeover in my car, it's got to look the part so that people don't think I'm a yeah. cop. And then, like, you know, like, that sort of thing. I feel like yours is built opposite to mine in terms of undercover. Like, yours is, like, to really, like, just yeah, be, like, cruising down obvious. the highway. It's, mine's like oh. a blend in, like, highway patrol kind yeah, of thing. Yeah, like, you just look like regular traffic kind of. Yeah. A little bit. I don't know. It's like if you have a hell, I feel like yours is like the guy who thinks he's obvious, but is just so not. Because it's like you have this Hellcat and it doesn't look like it, it's not like it doesn't have any flair like a Hellcat should. Like I feel yeah. like the this being slammed and then I. Um, I, th I just think your rim choice makes it look really like uh, kind of awkward as well because they're not very like big rims yeah yeah you know, you know what profile. that's, I don't think that's it needs any I think, bigger rims though. no I think you know what I think like it look is? how expansive I the cheetahs are I feel like your wheels don't look like they could hold up the boat that is your car yeah yeah like, it's kind of like it's like skipping leg day almost or something like, like that or like shack with size five feet yeah like i don't know, it's I, don't just, know. I thought they almost look like a bit beefier than yours though i just i i, I see I what you're so. meaning but like at the same time i don't like i don't know like the, they the spokes do like a t the I, spokes I are you thicker looking at the back wheel i'm looking at both of different. them looking at both of them honestly but they do look like a bit smaller though yeah they do look yeah they just don't look like they could hold it's up the your, immense your weight of the car yeah maybe i don't know but yeah i don't know i mean i don't think it looks horrible it's just like it's like it's like npc said there's nothing wrong with it but it's not like 
amazing either sort of thing. Yeah. All right. Yeah, sorry, Tonga. But I still think NPCs car is an atrocity. Maybe even a crime against humanity. I might even no, go as far as to add. Is... No, no. It I literally, it looks criminal. like, it looks like you live in California, is what it looks like. It's just a police <laughs> state. It's like, like, like California awful, in like 20 years. Terrible and like, just like scary. And you don't want to live there. I don't know. I mean, I, you, vote for me if you like Blade Runner. It, it looks cool. like it looks like a car that would be AI driven in San Francisco when San Francisco gets even more hellish than it is right now. And it would like clean up the streets of like all the like crackheads. Well, you know what I mean? Your car looks like Frankenstein with how jarring the pattern is between the hood and the primary like, color I didn't, the front. I didn't code the textures. Rockstar did that. Don't give me Yeah, really but, trouble yeah, but you, you chose picked, to, you like, picked yeah. chose to put it on. Oh, Twingo didn't do it. I didn't do yeah, it. Yeah, but like if you I put it on yeah, your car but like of if, your own free will. If I had gone for for Twingos, then like it my car would just be his car but like boring and in a different color you no know I mean? your car would be his car but cooler because you picked a better i think my car color i think my car is cooler color though combo. i think my car is cooler than twingos i uh, i'm not gonna say i agree or disagree i think the the carbon's jarring i think me still but i think the, i like me. your color a lot i like well, your there color you moves. go color is very close to my old customization model of this hellfire is that right which is oh, really oh, kind of inspiring right. i wonder if you took some notes from that well yeah. no original. i didn't actually I, I was taking i was actually taking notes from npc's cypher customization battle mm. oh base because you did something like this to your car but uh i do now that you say that i do remember that you did go for i think it was dark blue or dark purple or something galaxy blue okay well, wait wait go. hang on hang on i got i got one more thing I got one more thing. Look, look at this. Look how sick this looks. You do, not say it doesn't look you do sick. match your car. I will give you that. It kind of oh, looks like man. a Halloween costume with the pants, in my opinion, but it's kind of sick. <laughs> like one you buy from I, Walmart? I made this a few years ago. Yeah. yeah, fair. So it's, it's pretty like, valid. It's, these are, listen, they're 10 year old GTA textures. Like, uh, this is the best I could do. He's, he's right. Five years he's ago. right. Well, I mean, I don't really have much else to say. I think I think we've all kind of done something interesting. Yeah, so it's up to the, it's up to the viewers to vote in the comment section down below and let us know who the winner is going to be. So make sure you guys go and vote. Leave a like on the video if you enjoyed. Dislike if you didn't. Of course, go subscribe to NPC and Twingo. Vote on their videos as well. Subscribe to me if you're new. We'll see you in the next video. Till then, take care. Peace.